we are our biggest critics, like we are our greatest critics. We, we tend to criticize ourselves. Even when other people are not looking at us, we are looking at ourselves and we're like, guy, I can't step out like this. Like people will look, people will talk to me like, hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Debbie, and in today's video, we're talking all about confidence and beauty standards. And if you're interested in this video, then you definitely have to keep on watching. So let's get right into the video. So guys, <laughs> this thing about um, confidence. It's, it's a mindset. It works with your mind, literally. You have to tell your inner self that oh my, it's high time for me to start loving myself. Yes, and that's the thing I want to talk about now. Confidence works with self-love. Yes, um, when you start to embrace yourself, start to love yourself and damn every other thing around you, then you start to be confident in yourself. So a little backstory. I was um <laughs> it seems kind of funny. I was in the supermarket with two of my guy friends and then we saw this other girl. She was way too skinny, like she was flat as and they were like dissing and saying stuff like oh my god I can't be I can't be a girl like that. She's way too skinny, she doesn't have the curves and everything. I'm like, yeah she shush. You make this girl feel inferior. The girl heard me and she was like, Oh, were well, you guys talking about me? Well, I don't care. I love myself the way I am. I might be flat as fuck, be straight as fuck, but guy, yeah, like you guys, we're not on the same level. And I was like, Oh my god. I felt, I felt really bad at that point because she was talking to me and my guys, and it was kind of embarrassing. But the thing is, <laughs> She embraced that girl, like she was like, you can't talk down on me, you can't talk down at me. The fuck like Una no rich. You get it? Una no rich. A big personal for every level. That's that's the kind of energy that you're supposed to be portraying. You get? And so I was so happy but also sad at that point. And that's where I'm bringing the whole issue to you right now so being a confident person if she wasn't really confident in herself everything we said at that point would have really brought her down and she'll be moody and stuff like that but she wasn't because she saw herself as bigger and better like i cannot be talking nonsense with people they're not the same they're not on the same level y'all get it like if you get it you get it <laughs> So guys, what I'm trying to say is you have to start loving yourself to be able to embrace confidence. And yes, most of um, social media, most of those girls and boys on social media be making you feel like you're not perfect, you've not got the curves, you don't, you, you, you don't, you look like shit, you look like you mess. So sometimes I tell people to shut up social media if you don't actually have um, that kind of mind to carry it out or those people that make you feel inferior like you unfollow them for a while yeah and try to embrace yourself love yourself and if it doesn't really bother you you're a real G <laughs> so yes guys so what I'm trying to say now is you guys have to learn to love yourself first your self-love journey <laughs> That journey, that journey is the hell of a ride, literally. It's a hell of a ride, and you pass through a lot of things. You go through things like you see people that will talk down on you. You see people, you 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 know something about this thing. Eh? We are our biggest critics, like we are our greatest critics. We, we tend to criticize ourselves, even when other people are not looking at us. We are looking at ourselves and we're like, guy, I can't step out like this. Like people will look, people will talk to me like. Like, oh my god, that stretch mark on my body, it's, it's way too obvious. I can't wear this kind of clothes. When no one is even looking at you, eh? Seriously, no one is looking at you. So just fuck it, man. Don't listen to what other people are saying. Like, come into the back of your mind and live life. <laughs> Don't mind me, guys. So, literally, just embrace self love first of all and every other thing will come oh when we realize that we are real cute and we don't want any bad energy around us like we push out all the bad negativity and everything 
then we let the world know. <laughs> we let everybody around us, like we let the world know through our work. Like you raise your chin up, like eye to eye, and look you in the eye. You are nobody to me. Like I will walk with my back straight and my chin up. Hmm? I walk like I'm signing on a billion dollar deal. Like I walk like. I own the streets. No, no fucking person is coming for me. Like, no, you cannot bring me down. No, you cannot bring me down. So, guys, <clears throat> after we let people know that we are real cute, we should learn to also compliment ourselves and tell ourselves how beautiful we are. We should praise ourselves every time, like when we get out of bed, we should know that hmm, we are gracing people with our looks today. It's not easy to get out of bed in the morning and show up at a particular place looking all beautiful, all graced, all loving. Like, we shouldn't wait for people to tell us, oh, you look beautiful and say thank you. We should be like, oh, I know, I'm, I'm, I'm really beautiful, like, I'm real cute, like, you can't take all that beauty from me. <laughs> Because if we continue to treat ourselves like second place, like people sense that energy, like they'll sense it and start to treat us the same way. Because we know we're not second place, we always come out in first place. Conclusion, guys, if you guys have watched this video from beginning to the end, I'm trying to tell you now to be nice to yourself and embrace self love. Like, know that you're real cute in and out, you're amazing in and out, and God created you the way you are because. He knows that you're very special and you would come into this world to come and portray what he wants you to portray. So what um what I want you guys to take out of this video is you guys should learn to love yourself and embrace yourself the way you are. And damn every other beauty um standards that people keep because social media is fake. People always portray their life as perfect on social media of the way you are and you see every other good thing come for you and so you guys I've, I love creating this video for you guys and if you're interested in seeing any more videos from me then put in the comment section what you guys want to see next from me and I'll see you in my next video see ya catch ya later